Okay, so good. She's leaving and taking the kitten. I thought this lady was just going to move into our house, but she is not. We do not already have hairs, hair on the floor. Our tiny kitten cannot be. Penny, are you getting hair on the floor already? Look at her. Oh, she likes electronica. She just blends right in with this thing. I can't even see her. Penny, I wanted to get a picture of you. Penny! Oh my gosh, y'all don't know how long it took me to get that camera turned around so I could try to get a picture of her, and then she literally just ran away. Okay, well, I got a picture of her butt laying on that thing. Look at her. She's like, there might be treasure in here. Let me check it out, just in case. Penny, I cannot wait. I think you're going to be adorable. Our adoption is over, and they're leaving. What are you doing, and what is the noise that I am hearing from all over the house? It's right here. Here it is. We've been having this baby repair everything because he can't die a second time. He's tense about it, though. Let's see what Anna actually wants to do. I think that she might like to learn to knit. She's got all this cute stuff out here, including all these, like, knitting things. Yarn and books and everything. I think she's learning how to knit. Also, I forgot to say it, but welcome to another episode. <laughs> I just jumped right in because the cat lady was still here. All right. She's going to work on knitting clothing that she's going to give to all of her family members. Let's do some knitting, Anna. Okay. It says he fixed it, but it sure doesn't seem like it's fixed, does it? Our baby girl is sleeping over here. We need like a bed for the cat. Didn't want get one? Oh, there's a cat bed down here. Yes. Okay, well, I'm going to get rid of this thing. We've got some trash. Oh, I can take the trash out. How about that trash, too? No. He's trying to mop up from himself. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and get the dining room in a box and get the dining room all done and get rid of this beeping noise. I cannot stand it anymore in this house. You're going to have to go. I'm going to get rid of him and then we will, or that thing, I don't know why I called it a him, and then we will decide what's happening with it after that now i'm gonna do the dining room all up for for callie and we've already got dining room over here in this house with the stuff on it so we don't need to move any of this stuff out we can just delete it all and get money for everything well i got rid of it before i thought that we're buying it in a box we're not buying the whole thing so i might have to actually get the table back but let's see what we have Okay, well, here we go. We have changed the color of all of this stuff. Like, we repainted it. Oh, I have not done the walls yet. Wow, we are moving from a very bright floral pattern to a very dark floral pattern. But I like it. And the rest, the green of the rest of the wall looks good with it. Our pictures still look great over here. I love it. Okay, I think that's everything I got. I checked the floor. The floor stayed the same. I added our pretty pattern up here. Oh, I changed one set of, but I didn't change the other set of curtains. Okay, now our curtains have changed. Very cute. Definitely different than what her parents have, and I love it. And so here are the parents over here. They still have their little kitchen dining room living room stuff that they had before and they have this one bathroom we still have to do their other bathroom upstairs but that's going to be when we're ready to do this bathroom over here we'll move their stuff so okay there we go oh penny's gonna go use her litter box for the first time i've never seen what happens in here okay we won't watch that we'll give you a moment of privacy I just want to see if anything happens or if we have to... Okay, that's taking a little longer than I thought. Anna is done with her knitting project. Fantastic. Clark, where have you been? He's going over to chat with Anna. Okay. Okay, and then she's getting out and nothing happens to this. We have to clean it ourselves, huh? Callie, can you come down here and clean the litter box? There we go. Oh my gosh, I didn't know there was like a thing floating in here. Look at this, in our kitchen table. That's kind of adorable, actually. What can we do? Well, we're not selling it. Let's name it. Ichabod. Okay, I love that name. Oh, Callie got a fitness level from cleaning up the cat stuff. All right, Callie, what can we do out here? We planted an apple tree because we only had one apple. 
Oh my gosh, I forgot to sell our uh, thing over here. There we go. I think there's actually no way to make the ghost happy. So I'm just letting him take care of himself for right now. We are still trying to figure out what to do to bring him back from the dead. Absolutely not. That's the dumbest thing I've ever seen. She just went all the way downstairs uh, to go to the... To wash her hands and then turn around and come back upstairs. No, not happening. Okay, so she has to be friendly with her animal 12 times. And we've already done it nine. Aw, Penny is playful. Yay. Aw, adorable. Okay, hold on. You still have to do something else. That's only 11. Let's pet her. Yes. Now she has to be... Companions with one animal, successfully train out two misbehaviors, and be friends with five cats and dogs. And she's already friends with one. So the first thing we're going to have to do is teach her not to play in the trash because she keeps doing that. He's really hungry. Let's see if I just teach him, like, can you just grab a serving of this food? Will that fix your hunger? Oh, she wants to be a cat lover. I think that's great. Oh, does she have any food on this level of the house? I don't think she does. Let's get her a little thing of food. Look at them sleeping exactly like they're supposed to be. I don't know why it surprises me that there's two separate houses and they're actually sleeping in their own house. I mean, it's cute, but still surprising. All right, there we go. He put some food over there for her. Okay, she's licking in a puddle, so now we can tell her lecture about drinking from puddles. Don't do that. Jasmine, can you mop it up, though? <laughs> oh, gosh. The cat is also a glutton. All right. I think we'll go out today with Callie. She wants to get every plant that there is available to get. So, I think we're going to take her out and just have her go harvest things and just work on some gardening stuff. And I don't know what all she does have other than looking right here and we can go to gardening and it'll tell us the things that she has and the things that she still needs to get and so I know that Henford on Bagley we can go buy some and bring those home and plant those and so I want to go do that but first we're going to have her come down here and dig up some things really quickly she's still tending the garden but Everybody else is going to school and going to work, except for Clark. Clark's staying home, but, you know, if he's feeling okay, oh, he's better than Callie is. Let's bring Clark with us today then, because he likes gardening stuff too. He's out here selling roses for us, 679. All right, Jasmine. Atticus went to school. I guess as a ghost, he goes to school. Um... I wouldn't think that would be a thing, but apparently that is what happens. Oh my gosh. Hey, Clark, I think I have a crush on Billy Jang. Absolutely go for it. Okay, Callie. I see one ready to evolve out here. I'm going to have Callie come up here and use the bathroom and get something to eat. And Clark is going to go grab these things right here because he is feeling fine. And then they'll both be able to go. By the way, that is still our fruitcake made by Thorn Bailey. When we first moved into this house. And Clark is an old man and going to die. Oh my gosh, he's going to die. I mean, I knew he was going to die. But it's like it just occurred to me that Clark is going to die. Clark, why didn't you come down here and do this stuff? I wanted to look and I didn't even check it. I wanted to see how many gardening things. So we have 18. We will see how many we have when we get back. Okay, Clark, can you go over here and dig this please? Okay, now let's see. Clark found anything new. Yes, he found a piece of that that he didn't have before. Let's see, is this a new fossil? Nope, probably not. Okay, so we got some duplicates of some things. That's fine. I'm glad Clark is coming because he has all the things. And I think after they spend some time together today, he will give all the things to Callie. But we're going to take Clark and Callie and go to Henford on Bagley and try to buy some new produce and stuff. And I want to go to this downtown market area, I think. So we will go visit the Gnome's Arms Tavern with Callie. Okay, wonderful. The little produce stand is open. 
Okay. We're going to send her right on down right here to the Haggle. And we're going to send him over here to Haggle and see what kind of flower stuff he can get over here. Let's zoom out so I can see both of them talking. You drive a hard bargain. I'm going to give you 25% off. Yes, girl. So let's buy discounted grocery item. It also says we can sell our produce. So I think we're going to sell some of that other stuff. Okay, we're going to buy one of everything just because I don't know what we have and what we don't have. I know we have carrots. Oh, I'm going to get one anyway because that worries me. I don't think we have cherries. Oh, we definitely don't have dragon fruit. Oh my gosh, how much money? We've already spent $1,000. A glow orb? Stare into it. We dare you. Do we plant it? We're planting it. Hopefully we can plant it. Grapes, green beans. Oh, we definitely have lemons. No, we don't want any lemons. And we have pears. Wow, we just spent $1,300, but we got a lot of stuff. First of all, let's sell... We're going to sell the lilies that we that we picked this morning. I mean, we're not going to sell all of them, but here we go. Look at that. For 36, we're going to sell seven of them, so we'll have one lily left. There we go. Are you crazy? I'm already losing money at these prices. Okay, well, clearly he's not getting a discount over here, but that's okay. Let's go, Clark. I thought an old lady talking to an old man would work better, but it certainly doesn't. Okay, we have apples. We have basil, I know. Oh, we just bought some of this. Okay, I know we have a bluebell, but I'm not entirely sure. It's some of the flowers that I don't know, because those were definitely not over there. I wanted to get some of those, like, with other kind of mushrooms. Oh, quill fruit. Okay, that's costing us a lot of money for that. Oh, I don't think we have any soybeans yet either. Oh, verdant mushrooms. That's what I was talking about. Some of those kind of mushrooms. Oh, and some wolfsbane. Wow, we have spent quite a bit of money over here, but let's see. Just from buying those things, our garden now has 27 out of the 32. All right, Clark has all of our fruits now. I gave him every one of them. Not fruits, but all of the planting things that we found. Let's see what this is. A wild raspberry, but it's not pickable or whatever i'm gonna send him over here just to fish for a little bit while she like examines the world a little bit more and let's see what we can find so i know from last time i was here there's not a ton of like diggable space around here there are some <laughs> plants over here okay what are you doing in here who is this guy imram watson Oh, Thomas and Ramey Watson's son. Sure. Anaya Wilder is married to Wolfgang Wilder? That's Anaya Jang. She used to be married to Baco Jang. <laughs> Vanessa is married to Jules Rico. Okay, well, Callie, you're not going to get anything in here. Just sitting in here while your dad's out fishing. Clark is still doing great. Oh, and he just caught a cow plant, Barry. I mean, we've already raised one of those cow plants, so I would like to not do that again. Oh, Anna must be home from work. We just got below average. Anna brought home 3700 above average. And Clark called a goal, caught a goldfish. Well, he's caught three goldfish since we've been standing here. Okay, well, I think we have maybe done everything that we can do here for now. So I think we need to go home and see about setting up our garden space a little bit better all right so we're back up to ten thousand dollars what i'm thinking i'm gonna do is take all of the plants well let's see how much the we're gonna put the greenhouse over here so let's see how much the greenhouse is so it can be added over here okay so our greenhouse that we're gonna end up buying is thirty two thousand dollars so we are definitely not doing that However, I do want to move the trees out here. Okay, I emptied out Clark's inventory of everything that we can plant. And yes, I just dropped them all out here right now because I'm trying to figure out what is a repeat and what is not in here. And so that's what I'm working on now. Okay, so without any repeats, these nine are the only ones that we had in here. We had nine flowers repeated or 
nine plants repeated in there. The problem is this glow orb, I don't know if it grows into a tree or if it's a bush. So I'm going to put it in here and see what happens when we plant it. I know that these are trees. So we've got the apple tree here. Okay, so depending on what happens with this glow fruit, we might have some more spaces inside. I don't know what to do with the cow plant berry right now. I think we're just going to put it right here on the shelf. Somebody told me that if we... Oh, wow. If we plant it and let it grow a little bit, really stop touching things. And then we sell it, it's worth more money than if we sell it or if we let it grow. So anyway... We're not going to do anything with it right now. Our garden out here is going to extend all the way to here. And eventually I do want to have five rows of each kind of tree. But I think that these right here, these four are actually all on the same kind of tree. I'm going to go ahead and plant them. But if they're the same, we'll just move them back in the row instead of having four rows of five. But anyway this I'm so excited for how this is going to go we're going to get out here and start planting them hopefully I mean thankfully Clark is no longer scared of plants so he can get out here and start planting these and Callie needs a shower but she's just going to get dirty again so we're going to have her come out here and start planting these and I want to see what happens when she tries to plant the glow orb all right, it's actually getting dark outside. I'm going to have her go ahead in here to the bathroom and take a shower. Anna, what are you doing? If you're bored, you can come out here and water some plants, please. She's like, I'm just going to go sleep on this bench. Then you can go sleep in your own bed. Wouldn't that be nice? Okay, we are going to move the bathroom stuff over and then let Callie finish planting stuff in the backyard and then I think that is going to do it let's see can you no we can't okay <laughs> so let's take the shower okay so everything for the shower has been moved over here and this room is empty so we're going to get the bathroom in a box and get this bathroom all changed out okay here is the new bathroom we've got new tile in here I love the kittens and then we've got a storage unit here with a very cute... Can I move this mirror down at all? That's like the tallest mirror in the history of the world. Anyway, so I can't move the mirror down. They're just going to have to look up really high to see themselves in the mirror. Wait, maybe I can. Let's see. Oh, I totally can. All right, sorry. So there's the mirror. And then we have another little cat over here along with their towels. And then a very cool looking shower in here and that's it the oh nope that's not it I forgot we have this in here the cleaner the plunger and the cleaner for the toilet and then we have a spare part for some reason on the ground <laughs> okay that's great all right Callie needs to get out here keep planting you're not Callie let's see she's almost done she's got a few more left to go I know she's not going to make very much money tomorrow, but we are well on our way to having all of the gardening collection done. That'll be fantastic. The treehouse, treehouse, the greenhouse that's been made for us has a spot for every single one of the gardening things in it. And so it'll be great that we just get to continue on with that. Oh. Uh. Oh, Clark Copeland's long life is coming to an end. This will be a good time to get his affairs in order. Okay. We have to buy him one of the keepsake boxes, and he's got to give it to Callie. Oh my gosh. I'm very worried about, like, putting all of our collections in there. I'm not going to do that for sure. I'm just going to put them in her pocket. Okay. Uh, this one is beautiful. That is not what we're trying to do. This is what we want. Yes, this keepsake box. Okay, Clark, you're going to have to get up. And entrust the keepsake box. Wait, why does it have to be Anna? What, it can only be Anna? Okay, that's fine. Come give it to Anna. Wait, sweet angel, what are you doing? She's under the table. Look at her. She's like, I smell some food up here. Somebody's got some food. 
Don't ask me why I chose to do this 11 o'clock at night. It's because they told me Clark was about to die. And now I'm freaking out about it. Okay, we're going to put all of Clark's things. Okay, well, we're going to sell all of our duplicates first. Okay, so selling our duplicates only gave us $300. Because we don't have that many duplicates. So, we're going to give everything to Callie. Okay, his inventory is now completely empty. Callie has all of it in hers over here. He ended up with five elixirs of life. Let's see what he has. Oh, he's got plenty of stuff left. He could probably buy another one. Potion of youth is what I meant. Wait, is that not what I meant? That is what I meant, right? <laughs> okay, so he should have two more. Let's see. Yes. Okay, great. So he actually gave her seven before he died. Which is awesome. You just try to see how many you can have. Like, get as many as you can. Alright, he is taking this keepsake box over here. And he is giving it to her. I kind of wish they weren't wearing their PJs. But, okay, still a cute picture. Okay, and so now, Anna has been granted access to all the family secrets held within the keepsake box. All right, so we're going to keep it for right now in Anna's inventory. She's not even an elder yet, so I feel like we have plenty of time for that for right now. So they're going to go back to sleep. Actually, she can take a shower in her new bathroom and then, um, girl, go to sleep. We are not trying to kill him with some woohooing right now. Okay, Callie is going up to bed. She has everything planted, and we'll know probably tomorrow. It doesn't say that it couldn't grow, and it says it's a bush. So, we'll just have to see what happens when we actually, when it starts to grow. Probably tomorrow, or maybe in a couple of days. I don't know. Anyway, I am so looking forward to how all of our gardening is going to get expanded with Callie. We also redid the dining room and the bathroom this time. This little house over here is completed with all of their stuff moved over. And now we've just got a couple of this room up front and the kitchen to deal with as far as that goes, changing things. Wow, our little baby girl has made this litter box super stinky. And she's in the bathroom being obsessed with the toilet again, as usual. <laughs> okay, we're going to end this right here. And I will see you guys in the next episode. Thanks for watching. Bye.